This is day 12 of 14 days to opening your front door to guests. I have been doing videos for the last, this is the 12th day in a row. Um, go and check out the playlist and start with number one if you wanna know what in the world it is that we're doing here, okay? We're not getting our house ready forever and always. We are being super realistic and getting it ready for us to be willing to open it up to guests or just to have it ready for our family for the holidays, okay? All right, this is day 12. I know I'm wearing the same thing that I wore on day 11, but I actually filmed this all in one day and I'm so tired of changing clothes and I'm about to have to go get my daughter. Anyway, so here we go. This is the day where you are going to do a lot of work, but it's gonna be so worth it. First thing you're gonna do, you know, right? You're gonna do your dishes. You're gonna do a five minute pickup. You're gonna sweep the kitchen. You're gonna wipe down the major surfaces in your bathroom, okay? And then you're gonna do another deep clean of just the bathrooms that your guests will use. But you did it not that long ago, okay? And because you did it not that long ago, and who knows how long it had been before that, it's not gonna be that hard because you deep cleaned your bathrooms and then you've been wiping down major surfaces. So this is for you to do that final, make sure there's no you know, gross stuff, whatever, all right? So you're gonna make it clean. Then you are going to go back through your kitchen and do another clean of your kitchen. The worksheets, the checklists for these that have very super detailed, if you need super detailed instructions, that's what they are. You can get those um, in the link that's in the description here, okay? So you're gonna do the bathroom, Again, you're gonna do the kitchen again so that everything is fresh and perfect for when your guests come. And then you're gonna start dusting, okay? Use your room prioritization worksheet. If you don't know what I'm talking about, it's because you didn't go back and watch from the beginning. Um, but use your room prioritization worksheet. Go through in the order of where your guests are gonna spend the most time, okay? And you're going to dust, go from up high to down low. Um, according to how much time that you have, that determines how detailed you can be, okay? But do your best, do your dusting. Then get out the vacuum cleaner and vacuum. You know, a lot of vacuum cleaners, I'm not sure about yours, but a lot of vac vacuum cleaners can also do hard surfaces. So I use mine on hard surfaces and on rugs, okay? And on carpet. So then you're gonna go through all again, in, starting in the room where your guests are gonna spend the most time, that's on your room prioritization worksheet that we did earlier, you're going to go and vacuum all of your rooms, okay? As you go through rooms, if you start to see things that you think, oh, I can't believe I haven't done that, jot it down on a list, okay? Jot, jot it down, don't stop, you've got to do the bathrooms, the kitchen, the dusting, the vacuuming, but make a list of some things that you think, oh my goodness, I really hope I can get to that too. All right, if you have time left today, work through that list that you just made, but we'll have time to work on it in the next two days, okay? Don't forget, you can get everything at aslobcomesclean.com 14. That's where you can get the ebook that's printable with all of these steps, all of the worksheets, all of the checklists that you need. Use the code YouTube to get 50% off. Okay, I'll see you guys tomorrow.